In this video, I'm going to show you how to add an Amazon Web Store to your website using both WebStarts and Amazon.com. Adding an Amazon Web Store to your website allows you to sell items through Amazon and get paid a commission uh, every time you do it. So start by going to Amazon.com and scrolling to the bottom of the page and clicking on the link that says Join Associates. If you haven't already become an Amazon Associate so you can get paid a commission by selling products through Amazon, click on the Join Now Free button. If you've already signed up for an account, simply log into your account. I already have an account for this demo so I'm gonna log in. If you're signing up, make sure that you uh, catch up with me by signing up and then logging into the account. Once you're logged into your Amazon Associates account, click on the A Store tab located near the top of the page. Uh, as you can see, I have two stores already created, but if you want to create a new store, cl click Add an A Store, and then choose a unique ID or nickname for your store so that Amazon can keep track of your sales. Once you've done that, make sure you click Continue, and you'll get to this page where you can begin customizing your store. You can add all kinds of categories to your store. You can name the categories whatever you want, but for this demonstration, I'm going to name my category uh, baseball bats and then I'm going to click on this drop down and choose to my categories uh, from Amazon.com and for baseball bats I'm going to scroll down to sports and outdoor and then I'm going to go down to team sports and then I'm going to locate baseball and then I'm going to locate bats now I only want to display bats that are made by Easton so I'm going to type in Easton for my keyword and it's only going to display baseball bats that are manufactured by Easton. It knows that because the word Easton is included in the description or the title of the particular product. Now I can add as many categories as I want and I can preview my store look at any time by clicking preview store. It, once you've decided on your category and you've added a category description, uh, go ahead and click continue and then this is a page where you can customize the look and feel of your store as it's displayed on your website. Um, you can choose from a pre-designed theme or you can customize your colors and even upload your own uh, logo. Actually you can't upload it but just provide a link to your logo and it will be displayed in your store. Uh, you can create your own store title here and just click continue when you're done. Now the final step, you'll be able to select the widgets that appear in the sidebars for your Amazon stores. These widgets are designed to suggest other items for sale uh, to your site visitors. Once you've chosen those, go ahead and click Finish and Get Link. To add your site to your WebStarts account, click on Embed My Store using an iframe, inline iframe. Select and copy the code, then navigate to the page that you want to add your store to in your WebStarts account and click on the HTML icon, then paste the code in the area provided and click OK. You'll notice that the store is displayed and you can now uh, move that store wherever you'd like it to be displayed and you can also resize it to take up uh, whatever portion of the page that you would like. Um, make sure you put plenty of room at the bottom because some of the Amazon categories when they uh, page through display uh, a lot of information. Click Save and Publish and then click on the link to your site and your Amazon store will be displayed and now your sites can purchase or your customers can purchase things through your Amazon store and you'll get a commission every time that they make a purchase. So that's it for this video. Don't forget to visit webstarts.com to make your very own free website and see more helpful videos like this.